these all changes can be summarized or can be epitomized in on one page and that give us simplicity and ease or facilitate us to understand all these changes in state of matter and for that there is that solid on heating can be converting into liquid and that is the melting point. The reverse of it when we cool down liquid it converts into solid and that is the freezing point. So you can see it very clearly that all these changes can be summarized. So this is how I discussed about solid to liquid and liquid back to solid when solid to liquid is a melting and liquid to solid is freezing and if we convert liquid into gas, liquid converts into gas it is called evaporation but if it takes place at a specific temperature that is called boiling point. I will explain it further that what is the difference between boiling point and evaporation. The liquid into gas is the boiling point if it takes place at a specific temperature and all the molecules of liquid start converting itself into gas that is the boiling point. But below boiling point if liquid converts into gas that is evaporation. And if gas is cooled down into liquid that is the condensation. Also if we cool down gas it converts into solid that is solidification. But if we heat solid and on heating solid is directly converting itself into gas without converting into liquid state that is called sublimation. So this I like to illustrate more that for example in case of iodine, in case of ammonium chloride in these in them the basic particles from which they are formed they are arranged themselves that they are closely packed. So they are in the solid state when you heat them they have iodine or ammonium chloride they have weak forces between them. They have the weak forces of attraction between them. So when you heat them they are broken down and they immediately suddenly go away from one another and converts themselves from solid to gas state. And if on heating solid converts into gas directly without converting into liquid state that is called sublimation. And if we cool down a, the same gas iodine or ammonium chloride if we cool down them they convert into solid and that is called solidification. So have a look at it this with a very in a very easy way you can capture the whole points at one page. So this gives you a lot of facility in revising in retaining and in reproducing it on a piece of paper during exam. <laughs>